Hello, good evening and welcome to Mentoring Nuggets in 5. My name is Olu Adiaga. I'm the founder of the Christian Mentoring Association and I'm also a mentor trainer. I've been involved in running a formal mentoring scheme at my local church, Jesus House, for just under 10 years now. But I've been also been involved in informal mentoring for probably much longer than that. Now, I'm passionate about mentoring. I'm passionate about mentoring because I believe that mentoring is a tool that can be used to change and transform lives. And I know that because I've been a beneficiary. My life has, my life has been changed through mentoring. And I know that the lives of those that I've mentored to have also changed. Now, Mentoring Nuggets in 5 is a series that I'm going to be doing over the next few months. Where I'm going to come every two weeks to talk about different aspects of mentoring. But for today, I'm going to be talking about what Christian mentoring is. Um, what exactly is this thing called mentoring and trying to put a definition to it. Now mentoring is an age-old practice that dates back to thousands of years but fortunately it's evolved from where it was a one-way relationship where we you had someone sit at the foot of a master and the master just poured into the person, the person didn't have a say, you just, you just do as you were told. Now mentoring is a two-way relationship where both parties are actively involved in the relationship and both parties benefit from being in the relationship. So what is Christian mentoring? Christian mentoring is a relationship where one person, a mentor, comes alongside uh, a, another person, a mentee, to help to maximize the potential in that person's life. Now, every single person created by God was created with gifts and talents. Now the challenge is that sometimes we don't know that we have those gifts. And even when we do know that we have those gifts, we don't know what to do with those gifts. And that's where a mentor comes in. A mentor comes alongside you to help to develop those gifts, to maximize those gifts, to nurture those gifts. And a mentor comes alongside you to encourage you to use those gifts to impact and influence other lives. Now, a properly done mentoring relationship should be intentional and purposeful. You see, mentoring is about doing life together. God did not create us to do life on our own. We're meant to be in meaningful relationships where we're impacting each other. You know, I love a quote by Oprah Winfrey that says, a mentor is someone who allows you to see the hope inside yourself. And that's true. That's what a mentor is supposed to do. Now, a mentor relationship should also be dynamic, where you're in that relationship because you want to be in the relationship. It's a voluntary relationship. You enjoy being in that relationship. Now, I must confess, though, that when I first started, I wasn't as passionate about mentoring as I'm in now, uh, as I am now. Um, at my local church, we felt that the younger ladies would benefit from the experience of the older ladies. That's why we set up the mentoring scheme. But saying that, you don't have to be an older person to be a mentor. You could be a younger person, but you have experience, you have been through stuff that could benefit another person. So you could be a mentor. You know, one of the, one of the hang-ups that people have about mentoring is that they say, oh, I cannot mentor someone, my life is not together, or I wouldn't know what to say, I wouldn't know what to do. Guess what? You know, we don't have perfect Christians, and we also don't have perfect mentors. We're all in this life to learn together. We're all doing life together. And I must tell you that my life has been blessed and enriched by the mentors in my life and also the mentees in my life. So mentoring is a two-way relationship where we all come together to learn from each other and do life together. The Christian mentoring is holistic. It deals with not just one aspect of your life, but the whole of the human being. Where of the of, of whole of the person. So it addresses every facet of your life. That's what Christian mentoring is about. You know, I also hear people say that, um, so somebody in America or someone in Australia is their mentor or they're being mentored by a particular book. Christian mentoring is intentional. So if somebody is mentoring you, I shall know that you're my mentor. Or you should know that the, the person is your mentor. And the person should also know that you're their mentee. Because you need to be able to give feedback. You're exchanging ideas. You're setting goals together. You're in that relationship and it's purposeful. There's a reason why you're in that relationship. That is what Christian mentoring is about. So the mentor is there to journey with you in this thing called life. And the mentor 
will encourage you, will believe in you. And you know, the message is constantly saying, I believe in you, you can do it. A Christian mentoring relationship is not about control. It's about helping you to develop yourself. So I'm going to leave it there because um, it's only this session is only for five minutes. But I want you to know that if you have any questions whatsoever, I hope and I, I'm willing to answer all the questions, just send me a direct message. If you're interested in um, training to become a mentor, I would recommend the course that my association runs. Again, send me a direct message. But most importantly, I will want feedback from tonight's session. I know it's been short and sharp, but that's the way it's going to be over the next few weeks. Just short and sharp uh, sessions. So send me your feedbacks, please. And really, I want to say thank you for joining me tonight. I really do appreciate that. And I hope that I will see you in two weeks' time. I'll be back on the 7th of February, 8.30 p.m. GMT. Thank you. Stay blessed.